Hey everybody, this is Brian from PNB Homesteading and I ordered some new LED lights because as last week you might have saw the one video I put up about the flickering lights in the uh, mid-sized grow tent. I'm going to be replacing those. I ordered some of these Kingbo 45 waters and uh, they are a little less wattage compared to what I had in there but with the flickering and from the measurements it sounds like these will be pretty close and I'm going to also make these adjustable to where they'll go up and down. I don't have the carabiners that you know you hook on to lower and raise the lights, but I'm going to do the same similar thing with the back of these lights where I'll uh, actually put, you know, some cross tie straps across here and then I'll put the carabiner in the middle and hang it just like I do on my other ones, except I use wire on those. But these being so light, I figure, you know, I mean, you can see how thin they are. They're like half an inch and they're, uh, they're really light. So I can use the uh, plastic tie straps with these instead. And then uh, these do have individual switches to turn them on and off. So that's kind of nice. So I'm going to put my LED goggles on here and I'm going to give you guys a little sample of how bright they are. So that's kind of the way they look. And uh, we'll see how well they do with growing lettuce. I mean, they, they should do pretty well because I'm going to actually take these. And since they'll be able to go, you know, low and high, I'm actually going to use these as some of my starter ones like I do on that lower side, uh, the very bottom tray currently in the mid-sized tin. So uh, then we'll have two areas where I can actually propagate the new seed and then I can just let those just sit there on top and then raise them up as the lettuce gets bigger. And if it works out well as the other ones do die out, I'll probably do the same setup and put these in there for all of them eventually because these, these are much thinner and they can go higher and lower in the tent and I think it's going to be an interesting uh, thing to try out. So uh, alright, well that's the update for this. Oh, and uh, I got some of these, uh, these are kind of like a heavy duty tray and these are serrated. I'll put it in front of the lights so you can kind of see it. So they have a lot of little holes in them. I might use these to replace those flimsy plastic uh, you know trays like this. Let me grab one. Like these here. These are the normal trays that I use for growing the lettuce in the, the tents. And uh, these crack and they're not as durable and they only last you know maybe a month or two before they start cracking down the side and then I start losing the soil out this side. But these are a much heavier duty plastic you can see they're thicker and they're uh, they got a lot of nice holes so they'll sit nicely inside the uh, mid-sized tent and then the water will wick up through the base here so we're gonna try these out I ordered these from Amazon and I'll have in the the links down below I'll have the uh, or the, the more info down below I'll have the links for these as well as these new Kingbo lights and then you can also find that in the list of the uh, hardware that I use on the uh, pnbhomesteading.com website under uh, equipment so at the top of the menu there, there's a little listing and you can find it. Anyway, <laughs> all right, I'm going to get these wired up inside the uh, mid-sized tent and then you'll see this in the update for today's videos. All right, talk to you again, guys. This has been Brian from PMB Homesteading. Uh, have a great weekend.